So what was always pretty unfair is that the AI stats are randomly generated. So that me that means you'll have a high amount of strength and an and an high amount of agility. So he can just catch up with me and bonk me with a stick. Also in sports and sandals. Let's get a feel for the prices. Okay, so he asks for 9,000 for that one. We can do the tournament with this, I'm pretty sure, but I'd rather have a better bow. That's a tough one. I guess this guy has a lot of armor, so he'll give us a lot of gold if we win. Might be a pretty big if, but we'll see. I thought I still had ammo left. No mistake. Charge! Oh, why did I do only three damage? Okay, just one more quickie and that's it. Yeah, let's do this fast. I'm afraid he's going to crit in a bit. So we're just gonna back off a little because we can. And we'll just snipe him to be sure of the win. Let's go. Nice, nice. Okay, maybe good point in defense because the tournament guy in the next one hits like a truck and i don't want to face his wrath hopefully oh we can buy this that's nice and we'll have some left maybe we can upgrade our titty blades no uh no upgrades so that's a shit didn't know you were gonna be mad I have no idea where I'm supposed to get that kind of money, but okay. Oh well. Oh well. I would say we stand a pretty good chance. Maybe even more so if we can level up during the tournament, that would be nice. Fighting against bots with a high vitality is so boring because the fight just takes so long and they never do any damage back and it just becomes so tedious. So let's bonk him over the head a couple times. That's a nice amount of damage, I like that. So the cool thing about this uh, power-up is if you Psyche up three times without getting hit or interrupted, you can do a special attack which has a chance of doing high damage, um. unless they block it. Ah. But we're going to use um. it in the final fight against this boss, because that's the best bet we got against that guy, in my experience. I have no idea. This was the era before the high efficiency and meta stuff, it was a thing in gaming, you just played for fun and there were no best tactics and stuff like that. I sometimes do miss those days to be perfectly honest. Ooh. This guy's defense is so high, it's annoying as fuck. Yeah, I kill him. Yeah. 
So if we're lucky, we can fight the uh, other boss with arrows and he won't have as much defense, but we'll see. It's really hit or miss at this point. Liked another level, but it's not in the stars for us today. Mm, we need more damage than that. We, I said, we need more damage than that. Uh, this is not looking good, guys. This looks better. His attack range is yeah, his attack range is insane. So we're just gonna back off a little bit. These are the fights that are really down to RNG more so than anything else. Just kind of a shame because the skill and knowledge aspect does not really come into play as much. But that's alright, we can just take it slow. Okay, he pushed us, that's a good thing. Let's psyche up. And maybe if we're lucky we can hit him for an enormous amount of damage. I think the only way we're going to get through this is if we burst him down. So we're just gonna go and play the long game. That's what we want. We want him near us. So we're gonna suck you up again. Mm. <clears throat> this is what I wanted. And we're gonna do that again. Yeah, I think he can reach us from there. So we're going to... Let's get for the biscuit. Yeah. His damage is insane and he scares me. This guy hunt, hunts my nightmares. Uh, this is such a dumb move, I'm sorry. I'm a little nervous or something. Whoosh. Whoosh. Come. Come. Come on. Ah, uh, he bumped me over there. Hmm. Oh, this is nice. Yeah. So it takes quite a while to record this because if you die once you have to try it off from the beginning. Oh well, hope you enjoyed.